Okay, a system which undergoes an adiabatic change and does work on the surroundings has what going for it? All right, the adiabatic is a word that's probably throwing you for a loop because it's not one that's actually in our textbook. But technically all it means is that Q equals zero. So we have that basic idea that delta E equals Q plus W. Well, if we say this is zero, then whatever your work is, that's what your um, delta E is. So technically on my answers, there's only, uh, what was it gonna be two possible answers? That can't be. They could both be uh, larger than zero. This can't because they're opposite. That's their opposite. Or they could both be smaller than zero. So B and C, B and E on this are the only possible answers. But we don't need to actually do any analysis like that. We can actually figure this out. It says it does work on the surroundings. So the system loses energy because it does work on the surroundings. Since it loses energy, this is going to have a negative sign. Therefore, this is going to have a negative sign. So we're looking for one of these that says that they're both smaller than zero. And 